Whew. What's up guys, it's your boy Quick Nashi again, bringing in another great video. Yeah, it's actually a tutorial, so you follow along as I draw. Yeah. So let's get to the video, let's jump into the video. I should really stop doing that because I uh, the last video I spot my camera. So. It's like you just scrap the video too. I'll stop doing that. But it's just fun. You guys, we start off with uh, our shapes. Um, to draw a walking guy, you need to know the shapes. And I advise you look up what the name uh, references before you start drawing. Um, uh, I had a reference, I watched the reference that's earlier on before and practiced before doing this video because you need to practice first before you do something so with the bulky guy is some couple of shapes just some shapes uh, so we need shapes then i'll start off with the chest the chest because this is how it goes you just draw a circle a circle this way You can see how darken it up after using my two inch pencil. Have a first circle, then we we'll draw another circle in it, like a mini circle. Wow. So it's going to do something like this, something like this. Then we need to have the arms. So we are going to draw the arms, both arms. So here's, let me draw the, okay, this the line of our character, this way. It's like it's bent, so this is the line, the canvas. The action, the action pull, sorry, sorry, the action line. I know, I know, I sometimes confuse myself with action line, action pull. I don't know why. So, we have the, this, are, this is the line which is like, like an S, like a cable S. So, we don't, then let me, let me read right away. We want to draw him in three quarters. So this is it this way. Let me run and run this way. So this way no 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 stick. So we need to draw the arms as I said. So the collarbone goes this way. Then, because he's a bulky guy, so the arms are going to be bigger. They're going to be very big. So there's some something like this size. Okay, to me size okay. Also a circle. Circle another circle down here. Uh, I'll make this side faint because I don't want it to confuse me later. So, another circle down here. Yes, you are not I'll clean it up later. So, another circle, it seems messy. When you look at it, because you guys are so this this what I'm drawing. So here is the chest. The chest 
the cycle for the chest and the lower abdomen and the shoulder, the upper shoulder, then the arm, the for the, the the muscles between the, the the this side, this side and the shoulder. So he this the biceps into the bicep and triceps. So that's the muscle for it. So please forgive me if I don't know the name of the muscles, but last time I also will learn it. So so we'll draw another let me see a mini triangle let me use it a rectangle right now a rectangle over here. yeah okay a rectangle this way the human body is all about shapes if you know your shapes then you can develop it into anything you want then I'll have my this way. Let me use. Um, I don't know. I don't know which shape. Okay. Okay. Another rectangle. I have another rectangle. So I draw it off with a rectangle. Then we have it there. So with um, the arm, so now we have the arm, so we'll, we'll replace the arms with like boxes. So we have this, then okay, we have a big box because he is huge, so he needs to have bigger arms. Uh, I said arms, uh, bigger is it a yeah, hands? Yeah, yeah, the fist, right? The fist, so it's going to be big. So we cut because it's okay. So down we go from this way. Okay, there we have it. So the time I'm going to develop all these things into the muscles. You understand? So. And then also with the shoulder the other and you know, we have the same. Another circle. So add a triangle. Eh, sorry, eh, let me use a cube so this way. But we won't have it other full with this side end. Another with this because it's at the other end, and so it becomes smaller. Then we add a rectangle. Okay, we are going to develop or oh, don't worry, guys. We will develop or oh, I just want to teach you the basics how you can get the forms of the body first before we jump into. Whatever I want to do. Then we go into for the leg because because of this arm, we the legs some might not show. So with this side, uh, the leg, this arm is going to be. Okay, let me, let me see this way. That's like the football. Okay, let me, yeah, the American football. Like a football shape. And the other side, it's the same. From this side, coming this way. Into there, okay. So we are still developing it, but we're not done yet. So we have the knee. The knee, I don't know what I can represent it right. So, so it's like it's from the last two. We have I'm saying this way. That's for the feet, as we said, that's for the feet. Then we not a if I can draw, but 
this the feet then we have the ankle then let me see a red triangle no yeah triangle but I don't know why I can't do this one the triangle so from here to this side and let me see a circle small circle at the back so we have one of the feet so now let's get to the second one so they're going to we just need to draw our something like a circle but this way but like the ends are going to be wedged in like they are coming in this way so let me see now it's all like a balloon here yeah, like a balloon with the other side this way and then this side coming in then we also have we have the ankle here the other ankle then the feet coming this way okay then back in and up so as you can see we are we are getting the form of the character we are getting the form of the character and I forgot the I don't know the name of this the what's the name this the color something for what what the name so the head we're going to represent it with a square a box sorry so then we have it this way go this way this way yeah so this one A bit bigger now. Can I think I can clean this action line now? Because we've seen what the action we've got now. So. So now guys, we're going to develop our character now. We need to develop our character. You just wanted the form of the character then. We'll go ahead to add form to it. So now, I'll quickly add form to it. So you guys, let's see how I did it. So maybe I'll stop talking and do it on my own after then i explain how i did it all right I think we are done guys and it's not too much I understand you just need to hook up some references online and you watch as you draw or if you can yeah, all the name um
go for imagination. But I still need to the reference. You imagine it, then as you draw in, you move somehow, you add yours, you understand? It's all part of our daily routine, you understand? As artists, you need to steal, we steal, you understand? We steal, but we still to make it more creative. As you steal someone's artwork, you just move some and add yours. That's what I can say. And uh, I think we all learned, you know, we all learned. I learned, you learned too. Just give it a thumbs up if you like the video. Give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. It's, it really helps me. Please subscribe. And share it to your friends. To also subscribe to your friends, you understand? And yeah, don't be stingy. Just share it out. Share, share. So that's all for you guys. And I'll see you in another video. Ciao.